Okay, now, I mean, it's kind of interesting how on yesterday we had the random news about Terrence Howard retiring from acting after the finale, the last season of Empire coming up later this, is it next month or this month? Either way, another thing happened recently, which is actually good news. Um, Tracy Ellis Ross, Elise Ross did a story it was either on instagram or snapchat but in any case it was on the set of blackish and we're going to have a reunion of the four four main characters minus william i miss william of girlfriends now look i i get it look I, i'm a black man but i love girlfriends i got the dvd set i bought my mom a copy because my mom we would watch that the parkers you know sister involved as well watching moesha all that stuff like it was just great to see a cast of, you know, strong black women. And, you know, it's just one of those situations where, uh, who was it? Was it Joan, Maya, Lynn, and Tony, a.k.a. Uh, Jill, Persia, Golden Brooks, and Tracy. They're all going to be on an episode of Blackish, I believe. Uh, Tracy said it's going to be a feminist episode. And it's just one of those situations where I have no doubt that when this episode airs, which I think should be coming sometime in uh, October, I could be wrong, but it should be coming up pretty soon here. The only time I've been excited for a specific episode of Blackish was, I want to say, was it either earlier this year or last year? It was the um, 100th episode that was Prince themed. Now I got to watch this episode because it's Girlfriends Reunion. And we know, and I know for, we all know for a fact, when that episode airs, Girlfriends is going to be trending. Blackish is going to be trending. People will be viewing reruns of Girlfriends. People will be buying the DVD set. And who knows? I mean, we live in a day and age of reboots and spinoffs, but maybe there'll be a Netflix. And this is just me speculating here, but I'm just saying maybe there'll be like a Netflix spinoff or whatever the case may be where we can continue the story of Girlfriends because Girlfriends is one of many examples during that time where, you know, you have black or just successful black series that pretty much ended on open-ended endings. I think one of the most notorious shows for terrible endings was uh, Moesha and uh, One on One, just to name another great show that I wish got some kind of finality. So let me know what you think. I'm excited because I need to call my mom, let her know what's going on so she doesn't miss it. And um, yeah, who is your favorite uh, character on Girlfriends? Me, William, just because of the wit and, you know, being a guy. It reminded me of like a... It, uh, what was it when I was a kid? Kim Possible. It's like I love Ron Stop, Will and Rufus, even though it was like a girl's show. But at the same time, you know, that was the kind of show that was for everybody, even though the main character was female. You know, you had characters who were very diverse on there that made it so anyone could watch it. I'm 28 years old. Hell, I even watched some Danny Phantom uh, over the past couple of days, and the show still holds up from when I was in middle school and high school. But yeah, guys, um, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Are you excited for this girlfriend's reunion? I know I am, and who knows what will come from this. I mean, hell, we got another Bad Boys movie coming out, and um, that just goes to show you if the fan power is big enough, we can make things happen. So guys, thanks so much for tuning in. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and what other shows do you wish that, let's say you don't necessarily want a reboot or whatever the case, but let's say it's like, um, let, you know, if there is a specific character from a sitcom you grew up watching that is starring in another show or series, and it's like, you know what, I wish that so-and-so would have like a reunion episode on their series, that would be pretty cool. All right, so thanks so much for tuning in, and I'll talk to you all later. Congratulations on making it to the end of this video. If you like what you just saw, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, or if you have anything you would like to add to the video, make sure to leave your thoughts in the comment section below. If you want to keep up with me on social media, go to the description box. All of my links for social media are right there. Also, if you feel like you would like to donate to the channel, make sure to click on the link to PayPal. Any amount helps, a dollar, five dollars, twenty dollars. As a full-time YouTuber, any support from my fans really does mean a lot to me. Finally, make sure to hit the subscribe button as well as the bell notification icon. That way you're kept up to date on any new content I post to the channel. Once again, thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll talk to you in the next video.